Hello there and welcome to the dispensing clinic. So before you have your eyes examined today with the optometrist, I've selected a few spectacles after listening to your recommendations and I want to show you some of the selections that may look best on you. Okay, so I've selected these here. Let's go through them one at a time and I'll explain the benefits of each frame and lens option. Okay, so first up, one of the options you've got is to have some sunglasses and because you've worn bifocals before we can certainly pop a sunglasses tint with your bifocal lenses there okay so this is a wonderful frame of the beautiful design here it's a very sturdy metal frame. The tips can be uh, changed or adjusted if we ever have any accidents with these. I'll pop some new pads on these if you decide to go with this pair. But I just wanted to show you the option of sunglasses with a bifocal. Have your distance section at the top and looking down through the bifocals there, we can set that to your reading distance or your intermediate distance. Okay, it's a lovely pair. Now let me show you what they look like on the mannequin. Put those on there. So don't worry about the head dimensions of the mannequin. It's a little bit smaller than average. But this is how the frame would look. So we can adjust the sides there, so it's a nice snug fit, just next to the mastoid process. You have your ultraviolet protection on your outdoors, with the added benefit of seeing distance and reading there. So that's the first pair I wanted to show you. What do you think? Let me just take some notes there. Okay. Second recommendation here. Now this is moderate lens depth frame there. Again, it's a metal design. We have the screw attachment for the pads, which we can change for you. It's almost like a brown bronze finish. Again, the tips are detachable and changeable, if there are any issues there. Very simple, but lovely frame there. These lenses are clear lenses. We have no coating on them, except a hard coating, which makes them a little bit more scratch resistant. But I'll come to a frame in a second that has the anti-reflection coating on. But these are clear. Now you have the added benefit of the flexibility in the sides there for when you're taking them off and putting them on. What's your thoughts on those? Okay, and this is what they look like on the mannequin. Let me take some notes there. As well as being able to adjust the length to bend there also adjust the pads so that they follow 
your nasal contours and thus stay in the correct position as well as remain comfortable on your face there we go that's what those would look like now the third option is a little bit of a dark horse I know you like to do a lot of reading and you don't have a particularly strong distance prescription let's have a look right so very interesting these are aren't they the curved bridge there we still have pads that can be changed with the screw attachment here fully adjustable sides with a little bit of heat it's got a little bit of a wrap around design there silver finish these beautiful engravings here what strikes you most about these is how you have the metal at the bottom and none at the top it's almost like a reverse supra frame okay and also you can see how narrow the lens height is there now what these are these are half eye reading spectacles there we go just looking at them on the mannequin these are designed purely for your close work in terms of the prescription and then when you want to look into the distance because they're worn on the end of the nose you just look over the top to see ahead of you half eye near spectacles again if you're wearing them a little bit further down your nose I want to broaden the pads there oh and they have the flexibility there insides there we go and as you can see they sit on the end of the nose more or less you can look over the top to see things like who's coming through the door what's on the television for example not to be worn for driving wouldn't recommend that all right that would be something like a very focal specifically if you do a lot of reading knitting ipad tablet that kind of thing have a little think about that i'll just record your Opinions there. Right, let's come to the fourth recommendation. Now we did say we were going to look at a frame with an anti reflection coating. So, because you do a fair amount of driving and computer work. This is a very elegant frame I've selected for you. Again, it's a metal finish because the metal suits you very well. Tips here still have the ability to adjust the length to bend. Now, this frame is a very flexible frame, so it's very robust. And so that's quite a bit of give in the metal. And plain there, but the little red finish there. Little red finish. Screw pads again. No flexibility at the arm joint, but you have the bend as we said. 
simple bridge there, quite a deep lens. And if you look closely, as the light reflects off the lenses, you can see that there's a little bit of a green glow. That is the anti-reflection coating on the lenses. So it's not a tint, it's just a coating with a little bit of a green reflection. That's going to help reduce a lot of the glare you may experience on the monitor. Right, so I'm going to bring the pads in a little and just demonstrate this frame and our volunteer there. So it's a little bit wide on her, but don't worry. As I said, she's got quite a small head. But that's the frame there. From the side, the other side there. Everything is adjustable from these pads. What's your opinions on that? there. Okay, thank you. I'm going to move on to the fifth recommendation now. Let's have a look in here. A gold frame there. This is a gold frame. Oh, and we seem to be missing a pad there that can be sorted for you. So there's no flexibility in these, but still a very solid gold frame with the engraving of the side there. We have brown tips. Right, I'm going to pop a pair of pads on those shortly. Let's have a little look. There we go. What do you think of those? Okay. So you're not too keen on those. That's absolutely fine. So we have four options. If you went for something like this, because you've been used to bifocals, we could certainly pop a varifocal lens into the frame for you to try. Varifocals allow you to see far, intermediate and near. But of course there's no segment on the bottom of the lens. It looks completely clear, just like these. But your prescription is blended into those lenses. All right. You could still have the anti-reflection coating or a react to light lens in your prescription if it's similar to what we had last time. But varifocals may give you that little bit more of an option with the intermediate work that you do. All right. Now when you go into the test room for your ocular examination with the optometrist. They're going to give you the option of which frame, trial frame, you'd like to wear. Okay, we have the various eye sizes in different colours. This is the green frame. The optometrist can twist there to alter the orientation of the cylindrical lenses for your astigmatism. That's what the green frame will look like on you. Do you like the green frame? Okay, you want to see the other options, that's absolutely fine. A lot of people like black. It is the black trial frame. Exactly the same as the green. This is a 64i. So the optometrist will measure the 
interpupillary distance and select the right one in whichever cover you like so that is the black pair it's very bold isn't it okay how do you feel about the black pair Let's see what else we've got. Let's see what other options you have. Okay, we have a happy colour here. We have the yellow trial frame there, the yellow trial frame. What is the yellow? Does that make you feel happy? Excellent. Two other options. This is the 58i pink trial fryer. A little look at that. And this is how it'll look. That is beautiful. Matches the skin tone there. What do you think? And your final option for trial frames. Now this is quite a big one. This is a 66i blue frame. There we go. Have a little look. What do you think about those? Do you like those? A lot of people like blue, don't they? A cool colour. Arming. And that's how the blue pair shall look on your face. Okay, have you made a selection on which trial frame you're going to be wearing in the test room? Okay, let me take some further notes. I'll pass that information on to the optometrist electronically. Have a seat in the waiting area and he'll call you through shortly.